came out ready to fight. And that's what I told him in the post game um, huddle was how proud I was of him. And I would compete with any one of them all over again. And, um, you know, this is just part of our story and we're not done. We're not done. So uh, Megan did a great job on the mound. Um, Maddie did a great job at, a plate, on the, uh, at the plate and I'm, I'm proud of them. I'm proud of the way that we fought today. And, um, you know, we're gonna come back tomorrow. We're gonna regroup, come back tomorrow and ready to go. Megan, were you surprised that, that Ellis was able to hit the ball out in center field with what we had bowling in like it was? Um, no, I mean, I've watched a lot of film on Ellis. So I know she's pretty strong and I know that she's their best hitter. Um, you know, she just hit a good pitch and that's credit to her. Megan, um, thinking about the win and early, you guys got here early, you saw the win going pretty strong. Um, and pitching, did that change any of the pitch, anything you guys did preparation wise and pitches that you kind of wanted to throw during the game? Um, no, honestly, um, I felt like most of the time when I was actually out there, I didn't really feel like the wind was blowing in. I mean, I thought it was like, it stopped every time I was out there. So it didn't really um, affect what I decided to throw or not. <clears throat> A question for both of the players. Um, does the approach kind of change now that you know that you're in the loser's bracket and do you kind of embrace having your backs up against the wall? I don't think so. I think we come out playing every game. Like, we don't, we're not going to change anything. We came out ready. We fought hard. We were gritty. And that's our approach every game. So I wouldn't really say anything's going to change about that. Yeah, I agree. I think we're just going to come out and play our game. Um, I think we did that today. Um, you know, it just ended up being Auburn's day today. But that doesn't mean it's not going to be our day tomorrow. We're just going to keep fighting and keep giving it everything we have. Megan, can you talk about the approach that y'all had going into the game against Ellis? Um, you know, Ellis is a really good hitter, but um, we just, I just had to pitch my pitches and um, she made, she hit two really good balls and um, I had to give her credit to that. Um, that's really all that it was. It was just, she made some good hits like that. Um, the pitches were good that she hit. It's just credit to her. Coach, did you kind of feel like y'all had about one or two home runs that there that were caught kind of in the wall? What, what, what did that seem like on the field off the bat? I felt, I felt like that. I think we, you know, we were in the Kev, – Coach Kevin and I were in the dugout, and I'd say at least three of them would have been out at Lansing Park. Um, so – you mentioned that what y'all been through. Just talk about being shorthanded, not having your head coach, but also a couple players. That kind of how did y'all deal with that? You know, we we continued our process. Um, we we did what we could with our healthy players, and we worked. And they worked. They worked smart. They worked hard. And you know, we just continued to battle. Um, these got these these ladies are fighters and. This is it. This is it for us. And we just showed up every day and they continue to battle. Maddie, can you talk about y'all approach against Penta and how did you think y'all did overall? Overall, I think we, the approach we came into the game with, we did good with it. We squared the ball up a lot. We just didn't get lucky with some of the hits we got. Um, I think we came in prepared and everyone stepped up. I, we did really good against her and, uh, yeah. Was she about what you expected her to be? Yeah, she was. And I think she averages 10 strikeouts a game, and we had five. So what's the key kind of tomorrow? Y'all kind of played, you know, overcome obstacles all year long. Uh, um, how do you kind of look at what y'all have to do tomorrow? Me or, or the, the coach, girls? coach, coach, coach. Um, well, so tonight we're going to go back to uh, the film room and scout out um, North Carolina and, and get a game plan ready and get a lineup ready and prep our team tonight and then tomorrow. I think we play at three thirty, I believe. And um, the, the approach isn't going to be different, you know. We, you know, and I told our team today, we're playing one pitch at a time. We're, we're here to win one pitch at a time. This is the only pitch that matters. And 
especially when you get to this point in the season. Um, it is not to put pressure on yourselves, but you just have a short term memory and you come out tomorrow and we're going to fight. You know, we're going to fight tomorrow. And, and that's what Louisiana does. Well, Jerry will be back tomorrow. You expect him back tomorrow? I do expect him back as far, you know, he's following protocols, but I think he should be back tomorrow. Uh, for both of the players, um, just how are you embracing that message that your, your coach just said of not giving up, not quitting, um, despite everything that you guys have faced this week? Um, you know, I think that's been um, the thing that we focus on all year, in all honesty. Um, there's been plenty of times where we've had to make comebacks in games. Um, and so, you know, we're our backs are against the wall, but I think we do really well under pressure. And, um, you know, obviously we don't want this this to be the end for our senior. So we're going to give everything that we have because um, we're not ready to tell them goodbye yet. I think our team has gone through a lot this year. And we're like, we're ready. We're not going to give up. This team's going to fight to the end. We're not going to be a team that's going to give up. We're not going to hand it to them. And this is just one more thing for us to just get over. Anything else? Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you guys, Thank you guys very much. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Great base running today, by the way. <laughs> I really